Hello, welcome back. So don't forget to get a field guide page for the telescope, which is pretty interesting, but it says it's just a very good one. And over here, it's actually the one that you're supposed to check out, because, well, the tower looks a little different than in the picture, but it's okay. Lumos. The morph is here. I guess you can miss it if you don't look from the other direction. Huh, that was probably one of the easier ones to do. And now the problem is that you cannot do anything else. I tried to do some of the puzzles, but unless you get... Well, let me show you. The puzzle with the beasts and the roll. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. The ones that you have to... The secret doors where you have to roll the monster heads. You have to get a book from somewhere else. To show you what number they are. Uh, but to be honest, that's not going to be so fun. So let's just go to the next class. Because like I said, most of the things will be locked until you progress the game itself. By the way, speaking of the game itself, I think we're becoming a little too powerful. Oh yeah, this will take a little while. So as you can see, we are 255 HP, 5 and 2. And we're almost level 5. One less. <laughs> I guess we are one less. <laughs> you know, that, that has a very bad connotation in this game sometimes. You are one less. How can you fight me one less, right? You just have to get a book that will tell you what number these are, because these are numbers when you have to add them. So guess what? The first one will be two, and it... Now in case you're wondering, you can actually guess what it is, because look at this. The unicorn is one. The monster with two horns is two, and that guy is... I don't know what he is. Probably the harder one. So the unicorn is one, so you need a seven. Okay, so let me kind of try to do this. So I need the one with horns. And I guess it's a bit random here so we need the seven and I'm not sure what the seven is see it works it's a very simple puzzle that you can even figure out if you're just trying to do it without having the book without having anything any manuals or anything like Rebellion. that Okay, we got another school uniform that we probably already had. I mean, ours was pretty good because it was a legendary. So, this is worse from what I can see. I guess this, is, this one will be easier to upgrade. Okay, we'll wear this one for now. So yeah, as long as you kind of know the basics of the rules and you kind of know the first four or five numbers and they don't throw very high numbers at you, you can solve them. Oh, there's a book fly flying over there. In case you're wondering how do you get the books, well, it's with Ekyo. Oh, I almost missed this one. What do you mean a bookcase? <laughs> For what do you use the bookcase? Conjurations. Okay, whatever you say, game. So let's go outside over here. Revelio. And usually in rooms like this, you'll have books flying. And you're supposed to catch them with Accio. Ta-da! 
It's already solving two or three mini games. Cardinal's drops? Are they just giving me grobs right now? Oh, offense is increased by 6. That's super nice. Well, I guess it does look a little weird, but hey, stats are stats. So our progress is going very well in the game. Kitty? So I guess that's all of the mini games we have access to right now. I'm not sure how to open the locks. We'll probably do it another time. Oh, so close against Melet. Okay. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. i mostly. Hmm. Did I check in this room if we have anything to steal or to see? No, no. Okay, so I guess the game is pretty okay-ish if you know what to do. Rebellion. I guess we can explore everything Don't get later. Too simply because you had one victory over Salad. He never backs down from the fight. Oh yes, yes indeed. The music is becoming very nice. I just want to do it without teleporting because I'm really curious how the game will evolve later on. And probably I just want to, you know, see everything because it's a beautiful game. And magical as well. And I don't think you can go even two or three steps without realizing how magical it is. Rebellion. in at the present moment, the headmaster. Akio. I'm sure to tell him how very much you despise. One, two, three, four, five. Oh yeah, loading takes quite a while. Now, I changed my settings a little bit and this area is a little better, but still it feels like this is way under Rebellion. what it should be. This is the main hall one. I think we have to open that with a key because you only get one roll over here instead of two. And I'm pretty sure you need to roll two of them. Hey look, FPS is very good when you're near the door. I think we got the field guide from that one. Easy game, easy. Yeah, sometimes it's... It's too much in my opinion, sometimes the, the game barely works as intended. How nice to see you, my young friend. I'm not your friend. Okay, sorry about the lag and all of the stuff, but again, it's just how the game is designed. It's a console port. Console players will have a much easier time playing the game just because it's... What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. These goblins oh, are kind of weak. Excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes when I heard as much from seems Sorry Professor about this. Dick it's kind of you boring. quite a bit during your brief. I'd wager there's a good deal. Have you and Professor Fig not He continues to be reticent about the details. That's correct, Professor. Regardless, you must in that regard, I've asked 
Professor Ronan did... In fact, Professor Ronan will... Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade, I... We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including... Thank you, Professor. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you can't... There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine... I would trust no one. The discussion about wands is getting kind of off-hand. I've off, never heard of a hands. spellcraft before, Professor. What is... A spellcraft is a recipe of... I shall explain more about... Can you tell me more? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide... Professor Sharp asks that they have a... I'm E. Perhaps Sebastian Sallo or Natsaya. <laughs> okay, I'm almost afraid to pick one of these because the implications of picking one of these might be more strange and more strange than, than I think. I'd like to go with Sebat. Glad he to can do it. Mr. Sallow is a he'll keep you well. Rookwood. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, no time to waste. This Come on, stop to the butter beer stuff. Rebellion. Yeah, so I guess I, I really want to get a wand because that will improve my offensive power. <laughs> kind of weird that we don't have any class in this area. Rebellion. So I guess your only reason to come over here is to get a new quest. I guess he's grading papers or whatever. Okay, I guess we should go to that area because I really need some supplies. And anyway, dueling doesn't sound so fun when you don't have a wand. How can you duel wand less, right? <laughs> There you are. Can this guy be any more goofy? I don't think he can be any more goofy than this. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do. And an ex fixes things right up. Makes... Hmm. It seems... More frequently... Th As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not... A number of your professors have... I have arranged some for today. See them through and... Why must I fuck? No lesson or lecture. Such experience. I'll start on the top. Collect the flying pages near the broken statue. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Yeah. Got it. Levioso. Oh, okay, I think I missed this once, or I didn't hear them fly around. Rebellion. Anyway, everything is to make us a much stronger character who can beat up everyone. <laughs> Including the that page must be around here somewhere. Goblin. If only a new student were to help me with my sad predicament. Oh, if only I cared. <laughs> Akio. Brilliant. Well, I guess this is a simple quest. Are you all right? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia? I'm sorry, the others... 
That's kind of you. I wanted to make some new friends. My gobstone collection, that is. Are you familiar with gobstones? Little... Sounds interesting. Gobstones? That's what I tried to tell. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit. Imelda is one of the worst losers. And now those poor losers have taken... Rather... I'll say. Anyway, I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gob... If I knew that, whoever hid my gobstone... Haven't you any? Not really. I'll see what I... I'd appreciate the help. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and... Okay, I have no idea what this is all about. Let's just get out of here. <laughs> Everyone is trying to steal away my attention. Kitty. I haven't played a bad I haven't played a black kitty before. Of course it is the same kitty model with different colors, but it's okay. Oh, it changed my main quest. Okay, so let me see how I do the quest thingy. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zeno. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know. Let us give the old mending. Remember to be deliberate in... Yes, sir. Oh, I will be. This one Remember, to Hogsmeade. Your wand is a conduit of your magic. I think this is one they used in Fantastical Beasts where they repair the city streets and the other stuff. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a guilty lover brought it too accurate and lashed out. She has a knife between her legs. Okay, I guess I'd I can better keep watch an eye on ducks. high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Oh, I guess they are smelly, so they hid them very high up. <laughs> You're currently not tracking anything. I'm only tracking my life. Yeah, let's go to Hogsmeade right now. And then probably I'll end the video and we'll... Accio! Repairer! Levioso! Lumos! <laughs> I guess Lal doesn't respond to threats like that. Well, I guess... The gobstones might be... Mm, I don't care actually. <laughs> Wait, what, wait, what? Wait, this squish truck better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. You better go to Hogsmeade because you don't have no wand and you're wandless. Yeah, pretty cool feature. So, as soon as you arrive in Hogwarts, you are leaving Hogwarts. <laughs> uh, that's, that's pretty funny. Oh no, I hope it doesn't give me 
a stat advantage. Oh, it gives me a stat advantage. I guess we'll wear stupid glasses just because they give me a stat bonus. It's cyberpunk all over again. Oh, my cyberpunk character was so hideous. I guess that was one of Rebellion. the easiest secrets I found. Oh, these guys have really cool maces. Good and Morgan maces with the spike like uh, a spear and also eh, just a very big mace. Fancy meeting you here. Rebellion! Beltor, uh, just in case you're wondering, I have no idea where I am. I like these gloves because they make me look like um, the Colonel from Full Metal Alchemist. Oh, but the stats are so much better. I don't understand what the point is. You just get super good stats the more you find items. So. An item will give you two stats, and the next one will give you seven. <laughs> I'd like to stop in the house. Rebellion. Goblin artifact, goblin rebellion. Okay, let's not get overboard. Let's only move a little bit. Akio. I think I caught it. Rebellion. Is that a kitten? Wooden cat. Okay, we're getting to the bottom of this. Sorry, I'm just collecting random junk. Please don't talk too much. Please don't talk too much. Hello, Sebastian. Hello. Ah, mine. I'm told you're in dire need of supply. Is this your first foray? It is. Well, I shall endeavor to be the. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self can. Oh, he didn't talk a lot. Yeah, but we just got in Hogwarts and then we're leaving for Hogwarts. So in the next episode, we'll just see how badly Hogsmeade is made because people complain all about the. FPS drops and various problems with the game. I guess there's not much you can say about the game except for some of the bigger problems, but it's not worth the price. I think this is a 20 euro game. Because, think about it, you're basically playing a hidden objects game and following a storyline. And when we're really playing, we're just collecting stuff and solving mini games and sometimes combat. Also, don't see many choices in the storyline. I guess you can join a house, but you have been able to select or choose your hosts for a very very long time <laughs> and i think the other some of the other harry potter games had more interesting mechanics like you know gathering the beans using them as currency other interesting mini games more dueling more or less and they also had a very very fast game start the game would say hey you started go and now in this one you're just here you are here and they, the game says slowly, slowly, slowly. And just when you thought you had more options, when you think you can go anywhere, the game sends you out of Hogwarts. Just when you thought you were free to explore, get out of Hogwarts. <laughs> I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join. Rebellion! As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. 
You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Okay, so we cannot even explore this area. Okay, okay. I guess we can end the video right here. See you next time. Bye.